I've tried grinding, I've tried just prying and unscrewing, I've tried a crowbar, I've literally tried everything. Now I'm on last digit resorts. This thing's coming off one way or another. Finally cut that thing off. Holy crud, what was holding that together? I stayed up all night last night. It's 2.20 now. All night. I didn't want to stay up all night. I just... I was laying in bed. I was thinking about stuff. Thinking about the Jeep. The stuff that needs done to it. And for some reason I couldn't fall asleep. And since I had been thinking about the Jeep so much. I was like, I can't think about anything else. So I'm just going to get up. I'm going to get to work on the Jeep. I told myself though, if I work on the Jeep, I'm gonna make sure that I, I don't do anything that's gonna, you know, I don't wanna get covered in grease, I don't wanna get covered in dirt, I just wanna, you know, roll up underneath it, pop a couple things on, maybe get the drive shaft on, get the transfer case linkage on, and then that's it. I didn't wanna, I didn't wanna be hassling anything, I didn't wanna get all dirty. Well, that didn't work out at all. <laughs> Did not work out. Underneath that Jeep at like three o'clock in the morning, trying to get this whole thing figured out, and I'm over here like, torquing stuff down. The stupid bolt on the motor mount, it was just free spinning. I spent maybe two hours trying to cut that stupid thing off. Don't want to mess with that again. So since then, um, I slept till about 12 o'clock or whatever. Um, I finally went to bed at I think around seven o'clock. So I haven't been up that long. This is why it's, it's kind of hard. It's kind of hard to daily vlog when like I, I didn't film. I thought about it, but I was so dirty and tired last night working on the Jeep and stuff. I thought about filming it, but two problems. Filming at night, pitch dark, it's, it's really hard to actually film because you can't hardly see anything. Um, and then also just, I was working and I don't, I'm not a huge fan of filming actually working on the Jeep. Um, unless it's just a time lapse from a distance, which I think is boring. I was supposed to take the Jeep in the morning to go get the muffler fixed. But because I slept in, it's already like, you know, two o'clock. They're probably going to be packed anyway. So it's kind of too late for that. So I guess we can kind of just toss that idea out the window. I might do it tomorrow. The problem is days like today are the days when I really don't know what to vlog about because vlogs are basically just showing what's going on with your day, going through the day. You know, it's like what I do that day and stuff. And so I, I don't know how to make this vlog when what I'm doing is sitting at my desk, drinking coffee, watching YouTube videos and playing um, Fortnite, so. And yes, I completely agree. Minecraft is better than Fortnite. That's not even an argument. However, they have lightsabers in Fortnite right now. Can't even argue that. Lightsabers in Fortnite saved Fortnite for me. Like, they sold me on that. I think that that's the only reason they brought them in and it worked. Anyway, that was kind of off topic. I have ADHD. Back to the Jeep situation though. Well. I finally got bored enough to actually start working on the Jeep again today. I like don't ever wear gloves, but I have a really good excuse today. I really should wear gloves more often. I'm destroying my hands with how much stuff I do. This stupid thing. I literally melted that, that stupid rubber around there just to try to break this stupid bolt off. This new mount, amazingly, actually is bolts that go through into threads. So it's gonna, I think this is gonna hold up a lot better than this did. And just the mount overall just looks like a lot better of a mount. It's uh, whatever this is, some kind of universal mount. So hopefully that holds up better. I'm still dealing with that vibration and in theory, this might fix it. I didn't even think about the idea of the mount being the problem, but since I've just been having a loose mount, that might have been causing the whole vibration issue in the first place. I still have the styrofoam on that drive shaft I need to get off. 
Got it. Styrofoam drive shaft things are off. That drive shaft is actually awesome. It's actually that dumb thing is like as thick as my rear drive shaft and I'm starting to consider just buying an Adams drive shaft for the rear. With how much load I'm putting on this thing, I really think that I don't want to have to deal with popping the drive shaft. I almost thought about buying it today, but I think first I'm going to take it to a shop to see if they can figure out what the vibration is and if I can fix it and they can, you know, assure me that this isn't going to snap. I'll keep it and if not, I'm just going to buy a replacement. I also finally got my transfer case linkages. Everything's kind of just sitting here. I have a new plate and the new boots and everything, so it's just kind of a mess. But it still works and it's still more progress than I had before, so let's see how she drives. This is actually the first time she has been in four wheel drive since she busted actually. This is the first time she's had a drive shaft and everything. I'm about to try her on the road. Not supposed to use four high on the road, but I don't know, what else am I supposed to do? Four high, let's go. Oh, there we go, let's go. She actually feels really good. Um. So far, I don't feel anything wrong. There's still that shake, but that's the rear drive shaft, not the front one, so that's a good sign. Puppy, where's your owner? No, puppy. Cute little pit bull. Um, owner has been found. Taking the puppy away. Ah, I like pit bulls. Well, all things considered, I think at least the transmission Getting the new mount helped a lot. It felt way better than it did before. I still need to figure out what that drive shaft is. I might upload to see if someone's willing to buy it for like 150 bucks or whatever, and then I'll just buy myself one of the heavy duty ones. I'm mostly just trying to balance my money out, you know, figure out what is more important to me and stuff, you know, figure out what I need, what I don't need. I ordered the CJ7 tailgate. I actually got a really good deal on it. I also ordered something else that I will surprise you with because I, I, I don't know if it's gonna work or not, and I also don't know how to describe it. So, yeah, this is a weird vlog. For every part I fix, that is just one step closer to starting the 50 state road trip. So I was really excited to get that done. Tomorrow I might get a little bit more work done. I'll see what I'm gonna do. I wanna get that plate on with the boots, but I need to figure out what you Great, my battery died and I don't remember what I was talking about. So, I guess this is the end of the video. See you tomorrow.